Hey everyone, it's Raj from 3CB Performance. Today's topic is the left thumb dislocation suffered by the Raptors' Jonas Valanciunas on December 12th against the Warriors when Draymond Green swiped down onto the ball and caught that left hand. The Raptors' medical staff diagnosed the injury as a left thumb dislocation, which is when the joint is displaced, possibly resulting in ruptured ligaments and causing cartilage damage. My extra guess, based on the way that Draymond caught Valanciunas' thumb and where Valanciunas was grabbing at his thumb is that he has what's known as a tear of his ulnar collateral ligament, commonly called a gamekeeper's or a steer's thumb. The ulnar collateral ligament is a stabilizing ligament on the side of the thumb that faces the index finger, and Jonas Valanciunas had surgery to repair that ligament and other potential damage. The average return to play is commonly around four to seven weeks, and Valanciunas was in a splint the first four weeks, allowing for the ligament to heal, and then he was recently reevaluated on January 9th. The medical staff decided that he would continue to rehab to improve his range of motion, strength, and stability in the thumb. He'll be reevaluated after another four weeks. Now, the extended timetable isn't a surprise because the thumb needs maximal strength and mobility because of how much it's used and stressed during basketball, especially for a big like Jonas who's constantly playing in tight quarters and contact. Additionally, the Raptors are still playing quite well, so there's no real rush for him to come back. I would assume that the target date would be a return following the All-Star break. That does it for this episode. You can always find me on social media, Instagram and Twitter, at 3CB Performance. And please follow the channel, collect information. 3CB out.